Hey everyone, today's video is about when you get badly injured and they save you just in time. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Let's get going. You walk up to the sound of your alarm blaring, silencing the start of another eventful day at UA. Rubbing your eyes sleepily, you reached out to turn off the alarm, only to wince in pain as a sharp twang shot through your arm. Confused, you glance down to find your forearm, wrapped in bandages, a stark reminder of the intense battle you had participated in yesterday. It had been a grueling fight against a powerful venom, and you had been caught in the crossfire, staining severe injuries. Luckily, your lovers, Kirishima and Bakugo, had arrived just in time to rescue you from the brink of defeat. They had fought alongside you, their fierce determination and unwavering support, giving you the strength to overcome the odds. As you moved to set up, the bedroom door swung open, revealing a worried Bakugo with his signature scowl. He reached to your side, his crimson eyes filled with concern. Oh, Dallas, what the hell are you trying to get up to do? You need to rest and let your injuries heal. He chuckled weakly, approaching him and appreciating his concern. I'm fine, Katsuki. Just a little sore. But thanks for worrying about me anyway. Bakugo huffed, but his eyes softened. Of course I worry, idiot. You're my partner, my love. I can't stand seeing you hurt like this. As if on coup, Kirishima appeared behind Bakugo, a gentle smile playing on his lips. He's right, Wan. You need to take it easy. We'll take care of you. You nodded, feeling overwhelmed by their love and protectiveness. They had been with you through thick and thin, and you couldn't be more grateful for their presence in your life. I know, Kirishima. Thank you both for always being there for me. Over the next few days, Bakugo and Kirishima doted on you, making sure you were comfortable and well taken care of. They took turns preparing meals, helping you with everyday tasks, and even assisting with your practical therapy. Their unwavering support and affection failed. Your determination to recover quickly one evening, as he sat in the living room, Bakugo leaned across the couch, his fiery gaze fixed on you. You're healing pretty well, Wyan. Soon you'll be back in action, kicking villains' asses again. Kirishima nodded, his hand finding yours, and squeezing it gently. But don't rush it, Wyan. We want you to be fully healed before you go back out there. Your safety is our top priority. He smiled gratefully, feeling overwhelmed by their love and care. I promise I won't push myself too hard. I trust you both to take care of me. Days turned into weeks, and as your injuries healed, you slowly regained your strength. Baku and Kirishima continued to support and encourage you, knowing that your return to the field was imminent. Their confidence in your abilities were infectious, and it spurred you to train harder than ever every day. Finally, the day arrived when you were given the green light to resume your work. You suited up, ready to face whatever challenges laid ahead. Baku and Kirishima stood by your side, their pride and love evident in their eyes. You've got this, Wyan. Kirishima exclaimed his voice filled with unwavering belief. Remember, we're always here for you. Bakugo smirked, his confidence radiating. Make sure to kick some serious ass out there, dumbass. We'll be right behind you, watching your back. With their words echoing in your mind, you stepped out into the world, a hero ready to protect and serve. The battles were tough, but you fought alongside Bakugo and Kirishima. A formidable trial that struck fear into the hearts of villains. No matter how dangerous the situation, they were there to shield you from harm, to lend their strength and unwavering support. 
together. You fought as one, their fiery spirits fusing with yours, creating an unstoppable force. As the sun set on another victorious day, you returned home, battered but triumphant. Baku and Kirishima enveloped you in a warm embrace, their presence a comforting bond to your weary soul. We're proud of you, Ayan. Baku whispered, his voice filled with genuine affection. You're truly the strongest hero I know. Kirishima nodded, pressing a tender kiss to your forehead. We love you, Ayan. Always remember that. You smiled, feeling their love surround you like a protective shield. I love you both, too. Thank you for saving me. In more ways than one. Together, you embraced the future, knowing that as long as you had each other, you could overcome any obstacle that came your way. With Bakugo and Kirishima by your side, your love burned brightly, illuminating the path ahead and ensuring that no darkness could ever extinguish your fairy spirit. In the days that followed, you continued to work as a team. Baku's explosive power and Kirishima's unyielding determination perfectly complemented your own skills, creating a force to be reckoned with. Valens trembled at the sight of the three of you, knowing they were not facing not only one powerful hero, but a trio. However, as your relationship deepened, so did the challenges you faced. The life of a hero was never easy, and the danger seemed to escalate with each passing day. There were moments when fear threatened to consume you, but Bakugo and Kirishima were always there, their unwavering support never failing. So as you resumed your hero duties, the memories of that fateful battle lingered. A testament to the link, Baku and Kirishima were willing to go to protect you. It strengthened your resolve and deepened your love for them. In the face of danger, you faced it head on, knowing that you had not one, but two fierce heroes fighting by your side. Together, you forged a path through adversity, your love a beacon of light in the darkest of times. And as you face each new challenge, he knew, without a doubt, that no matter what happened, Bakugo and Kirishima would always be there to save you, just in time, that you would never actually get badly injured, as you would imagine that you would, because they were always there, and they had your back no matter what happened. So, what you thought was, you will never, ever... Be scared of the villains as long as you had them. Thank you guys for listening. I hope you liked this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Goodbye.